What is up, guys? Bonus episode number two here. And, uh, yeah, let's start looking for... It's time for the Hound Hour Scour Hour. Uh, uh, oh, yeah, call me a lyricologist. Because I'm not an apologist. Okay, anyway. <laughs> like the butter. Let's do it, guys. Alright, hope you guys are doing good today. How's it going? Flood mob number 14 here. In the last bonus episode, we, uh, yeah, we tried to find an area without multi sec And, uh, yeah, I mean, I, I actually checked the editing on this on that last episode. Yeah, that, that was 30 minutes. What? That is crazy. That is really, 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 really bad luck to die fighting. Uh, I mean, I understand some encounter rates are low. Like, I remember looking for, uh, like, even Dunsparce and, like, uh, uh, Gold, Silver, and Crystal. Yeah. Like, as a kid, I had no idea the encounter rate was 1%, but I did know that Dunsparce was in the cave there. Like, I think that's one of the Pokemon I looked for, and then, like, you know, I just wanted to just to have it, you know, I think I was working on the Pokedex or whatever, but, and I didn't know about Swarms either, but, like, even at a 1% encounter, I remember as a kid, like, the longest it did take me to find it, it was about, like, 25 minutes, but eventually I did find it, you know what I mean? But, like, we didn't find a Flareon at all, which, like I said, that's crazy, man. It's crazy. It really is. In, in, in 30 minutes, like, that's... I don't even know what to think, man. <laughs> hey, that's just the way it goes, I guess. Oh, this thing does have Fury Attack. But we're gonna stay with Rage, because the second he hits us with Fury Attack, our Rage is gonna go through the roof. So... <laughs> Alright. Alright. But, uh, yeah, you know, that, that was crazy, man. That was crazy. We didn't run into one at all, but it, it's whatever. All right, I'm ghost type. You can't hit me with the uh, fury attack. So, hey, hey. Yeah, that's what you get for all those sand attacks. Farfetch, you can't even touch this. You can't touch this. Dun, 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 dun. Uh, but anyway, yeah. So, this bonus episode, we're going to make it a lot. Oh, there's a hound hour right now. Yeah, we're going to make this one a lot shorter. I'm thinking around 20 minutes, so we'll stop at uh, 3.30, I mean, 1.33. 1.33 on this one. Because, yeah, that, <laughs> I mean, for even for a bonus episode, that's, you know, 30 minutes is a little bit too long. We're getting into mainstream territory. Uh, plus, okay, we will kill it. <laughs> all right, all right. At least we did find one. We found what we're looking for. We just needed to have the right ability. Oh, right, you are a ghost. Um, let's get out of here. Let's go with this Pokemon. <laughs> uh, oh, wait, I'm already in battle. Uh, Ice of Iron, you do it, buddy. take care of the uh, the Team Galactic stuff there. Uh, oh, and spoilers, yeah. There's an evil team in this game. But uh, yeah, after we take care of the Team Galactic stuff there, and I think there's like something with Dawn or whatever. Uh, unknown. <laughs> I could try to catch this. Doesn't this thing have Intimidate? <laughs> That's really funny. Uh, but yeah, after we take care of the stuff there, then um, I think we'll head in the uh, main series video. We'll basically start heading toward... Uh, Town, yeah, so that'll be a little exciting. New town, and there's the stuff uh, with uh, Team Galactic there as far as the windmill, yeah. So, oh, we printed well. Oh, well. Uh, 
at least we get the EXP. So yeah, that's the plan with the uh, the future, you know, mainstreams episodes. But you know, it's not really spoilers. I mean, if you're watching this, you probably like Pokemon. This this is probably like your favorite generation or whatever. So I mean, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe this is your first time watching Pokemon, watching this episode. In which case, I have just one question for you. I just start with the bonus episode. Yeah, that's. Uh, I, I mean, thank you, thank you for watching. But uh, yeah, you should probably uh, you should probably start with the regular one. Uh, what move are we learning? <laughs> oh, bite! Wow, that's good. Uh, let's get rid of scratch. Yeah, like I said, I actually like a rage better because um, yeah. The enemy, the enemy AI doesn't really account for it, so yeah, we'll go with Bite. Pretty good move, can make Pulp the other foe flinch. So yeah, nothing else, that's, that's good. We got Bite for Croconaw in these bonus episodes, so that is that is something. Trust me. And plus, I think it's our first Dark-type coverage, isn't it? I'm pretty sure it is, yeah. Ooh, okay. Alright, we'll switch to our Electivire. Because you're actually quad weak to fighting. Well, I guess by contrast, I'm quad weak to fighting, so. But I go. <gasps> I'm still tight. Uh -huh. You had me there in the beginning, Electivire. Not gonna lie. Alright. Alright, and I'll heal Electivire a little bit. Uh, let's see. Items. Don't we have like a super potion? Uh, we do. Okay. There you go, Electivire. All better, buddy. All right. All right. Well, we ran into Hound Hour pretty early, but uh, let's see if we can run to another one here. There we go. Hey, buddy. All right. Now let's check the ability as per usual, and it is. Oh, it has plus. Okay. All right. All right. We'll take it out. We'll take it out. All right. Let's go with Why Fry hasn't seen some action eat lately, so yeah. All right. Then chat. circle guys <laughs> next thing you know we'll run into a ditto and it'll have uh it'll have speed boost all right another hound hour good 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 that's ultimately what we want we want to run into as many as possible let's check the ability it is all right skip them out jj oh plus oh man <laughs> oh man i know there's got to be another ability because um yeah, we caught uh, Rebrakon, who has two different abilities. We also ran into uh, two different Parasects with different abilities as well, so... I know every Pokemon has two abilities, it's just, you know... So far, Plus is definitely the more common ability, you know? Alright, alright. It's all good. It's all good. We'll keep going. Uh, what level is Boo, by the way? Uh, okay, 13. When he gets to level 14, we'll start switching everybody out to make him level 14. Another Hound Hour. Okay, you know what? I'm okay with this Hound Hour. At least you're showing up more than Flareon. That's, honestly, that's encouraging. Makes me think we can do this. All right. What's he got, JJ? Plus. Okay. All right. Do -do 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 -do. You know, how funny would it be, right? thought of this. How funny would it be if the other Pokemon ability he had was Minus? <laughs> oh 
Oh, bro, I would be, not gonna lie, I'd be a little salty, just, just a teeny bit, just a, just a little, you know, upset about that, but, <laughs> but it would be for good, a good, funny, you know, part of the episode, like, ah, you know, <laughs> he spent 20 minutes just to basically get the same thing, the same ability, you know? <laughs> that would be pretty funny, alright, we got the paralysis, okay. Yeah, that is quite effective. I'm gonna need you not to do that, buddy. All right. Oh, I get a crit. Nice Good job, Ice Fire. All right. All right. So we still got about like 12 minutes in this bonus episode left. Let's see. Or see. Wait, that that's the first one we ran into. Uh, let's just. Uh, we're just gonna. Uh, sorry, I'm using my official. Soldier Boy features. Okay. Wow, this thing must be pretty rare. Not as rare as Flareon. Uh, does not affect Horsey. What's that ghost? It's a spooky Horsey. Ooh. It's level 8. I think you can take a water gun. Uh oh. Stop, 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 stop. No! Good thing I used my Soldier Boy. Oh, oh! Oh, would you look at that? Hey, we ran into a horsey. What is up, guys? Welcome back to Pokemon Platinum Randomizer. Yeah, hey, nice of you to join the episode. We just ran into a horsey here. And, uh, yeah, I was in the middle looking for a hound. I figured we'd give it a try. First try, first time we've ran into this horsey. So, you know, we're just gonna... Right, right. Oh, it's, re oh, it's ghost time. Oh, no. Well, I guess I'll have to use a different attack. I had no idea it was ghost type. How can I possibly know that? Um, Let's switch to Lava Fly. Yeah, it's only level seven, so it's got smog though, so I doubt it'll you know knock it out. The smoke screen is slightly annoying though, so there's that. All right, and hopefully this won't poison it. I guess I should have went with Rock Smash, but uh, it's okay. Anyways, how are you guys doing today? Today is July. <laughs> okay, let me quit. <laughs> okay. Smash doesn't affect right, it's ghost type. What am I thinking? Okay, well, this is gonna take a little while, so let's just, in the interest of time, let's just speed this up, shall we? All right, and wow, at this point, I kind of want to poison it, honestly. Uh, okay, 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 we poison it, we poison it. Okay, we'll slow it back down, we'll slow it back down. Okay, <laughs> uh, let's send out. Uh, Fry, you get in here, buddy. And I'll wait until it's like yellow in the poison, and then we'll try to catch it. That sounds good. Uh, does Wi Fry have an attack that doesn't do anything? Oh, yeah, I have Thunder Wave. That'll work. That'll work. Okay, so let's use Thunder Wave. Alright. And I guess it is a bonus episode, so you know what? We're getting into the yellow here. Yeah. Sorry for the speed up, you know, annoys you, but you know. Obviously, we're just trying to, you know. Okay, we're just trying to catch a thing. Okay, okay, ball go! Alright, guys, first try. I'm gonna get on my first try. And not knock it out, because that would never happen. Alright, and three. Yes! Alright, we got horsey. Sweet. First try, guys, first try. <laughs> oh! Horsey, that dragon Pokemon. It makes us miss in this shape of course. If it sits its danger, it spits murky ink and flees. Ghost ground type. Wow, normally that's uh it's like clay dolls type, right? So I guess we'll name you uh clay doll. Oh wait. Uh, a ghost horse. Hmm. There's definitely a joke here. I can't Ooh, what about like the headless horseman? This is the horse of the headless horseman. So we're gonna name it. Just for short, we're gonna name it H H's H H's. That stands for headless horseman. Yeah, H H's horse. Yeah, the headless horseman's horse. All right, there we go. <laughs> uh, looks like I spelled shores there or or shore, but you guys know what I meant there. You guys know what it stands for. Yeah, we got the horse of the headless horseman. Turns out the horse was a ghost too. Not big surprise. Uh, I'm just heading back to, you know, heal my PP and uh, check its ability and stuff. 
But yeah, we'll head back down and uh, we looks like we got another eight minutes to look for Hound Hour. Uh, but we did accomplish something in this bonus episode. We caught a horsey, so. I actually really like horsey. It's one of my favorite Pokemon. Um, I actually liked it before Gen 2, before it evolved into uh, uh, Kingdra. So the fact that Kingdra came out made, basically made it even better. All right, Horsey, what's your ability? Ooh, Hardy, okay. <laughs> Bad dreams? Wow, that's actually really good. Um, okay, okay, and like Ground Ghost? Uh, there are quite a few weaknesses, like Dark, Ghost, Water, Ice, Grass. But Bad Dreams, that is pretty cool. And I do like Horsey, so if we can find a sleeping move, I will consider using it. Um, let's check the level of all my other Pokemon, too. Right, Rock Terra. Uh, you know what? Um, all we're, we're just looking for Pokemon right now. I'm really, really unsure if I want to use Rock Terra, because it does have still quite a few weaknesses. But, you know, we'll just take it with us for now. And, um, yeah, because all we're doing is basically leveling up and looking for uh, Hound Hour in the meantime. So, yeah, I don't know if Rock Terra is going to stick around, but we'll just we'll give it a few levels in case I change my mind or something. So, also it may like learn a move that um, I'm just not remembering right now that I do want um, on a Torterra. So, yeah, yeah. So we'll, we'll we'll just we'll give it a few levels just to you know get it closer to where it's not quite out of the level range of everything else. And yeah, we'll go look for Hound Hour for another eight minutes or so. And, Guys, let's go. All right. Well, at least I did get to catch like one of my favorite Pokemon, Horsey. That's that's good. That makes me feel, you know, good about this bonus episode. Even though we technically haven't found we were originally looking for, I do love Horsey. All right. Let's see what moves you've got, Rock Terra. Uh, I guess Tackle. This thing's Dragon type, right? Yeah. I think it was a bonus episode so I could speed up catching that horse, you know. Because, <laughs> man, it, it kept using smokescreen. Uh, I mean, the poison damage seemed to keep taking a long time. Like, that would have been an annoying battle, honestly, to have in the main recording. <laughs> oh, yeah. Alright, Rock Terra. Oh, you missed. It's okay, buddy. At least this thing didn't try to use stun score on me. That's, that's good. Tira. Nice. Okay, but I will switch his moves. Uh, let's leave... Um, yeah, I like Rage with Leaf being first, but I'll put Tackle here and Absorb here. There we go, there we go. From most powerful to least powerful. Uh, by the way, don't I have like a Miracle Seed or something? Um... Oh no, I do have these for um, uh, Crocodile though. Yeah, I have this, the Metal Plate. That'll work. Okay. And then for um, the black glasses, let's let's give Croconaw a cool pair of sunglasses. Oh, yeah. And it makes it more powerful. <laughs> Sweet. All right. Let's see if we can found, find some pound hours. We found Electivire. Okay. So this is what? What type is it? Grass Steel, right? Grass Steel. I don't think Zorterra can do much here. Uh, it is... Ice Steel, yeah. Uh, we'll just switch, we'll just switch. Uh, 
Mana mana fi. Now kick, 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 kick. Punch. Pump, 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 pump. Now chop, 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 and block. My chop, 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 block. Uh, that's a uh, Parappa the Rappa. That's uh, that's, uh, that's actually a pretty obscure game, so I wouldn't be surprised if you guys are, you know, never heard that song before in your life. But uh, yeah, pretty cool game. I used to play that one as a kid. Uh, yeah, yeah, we were actually pretty lucky. Uh, yeah, uh, my dad actually, you, you know how like you always like as a kid like um, you talk to your friends in elementary and you're like, oh man, I wish my dad worked at a toy store, you know? Yeah. I was that kid, yeah, I, I was actually pretty lucky that, uh, I mean, my dad didn't work at a toy store for, uh, uh, oh, did I accidentally use Lear or something? Um, but, uh, yeah, like, around when I turned, uh, seven years old, he got a job at, uh, KB Toys, yeah, which is, uh, pretty cool, honestly. Definitely was my introduction to video games in general, and that's probably the reason I like, uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! so much as well. And, um, yeah, because of that, uh, I got access to Yu-Gi-Oh! and Yu-Gi-Oh! cards, like, um, I got exposed to, like, anime in general, and just a bunch of different stuff that, you know, I probably wouldn't have been exposed to otherwise, so, um, yeah, very cool, you know, and yeah, yes, they did, like, if a toy was, like, you know, defunct or something, or, like, had, like, a defect with it, you know, we could take it home, so we did end up getting, you know, quite a bunch of different free, free toys. Plus, plus, he got like a discount, you know. He got, and not only that, he got a manager's discount, which is, you know, pretty awesome, you know. So, you know, what free toys we didn't get, we got a discount on the ones that, you know, you know. yeah, and also like games, game systems and stuff. So, pretty cool, honestly, pretty cool. Yep, uh, those were the good old days. Man. I remember getting him getting a Sega Dreamcast too, like when it uh basically when it first came out, and like man, we we were all in love with that thing. The Sega Dreamcast was so cool. We played like Sonic Adventures on there, it was just awesome, it was so awesome. Uh yeah. Yeah, but yeah, we were actually able to buy like I think like four memory cards for everybody and everything. You know, because we have a pretty big family here, so yeah, we just all uh yeah, we all played different things, and like my dad, uh, he also bought like a, eventually like a PlayStation, just a regular PlayStation, and then I, I got to play like Dead or Alive on there, which, you know, I probably shouldn't have been playing as a kid, but it was, it was one of my older sister's games, so, you know, I definitely got exposed to that game as well, uh, and, you know, similar, you know, fighting style games, uh, at an age where, you know, number one, I probably shouldn't have been, but, you know, number two, I got to play them, you know, uh, anyway, which is pretty cool, honestly, pretty cool, you know, and as well, like, you know, he also bought, like, games for, uh, you know, for us, you know, because, uh, we're the only boys, uh, I, ha I have, uh, like, five, five other sisters, um, but he also bought, like, Madden, you know, uh, the, the, the original Madden, like, on, uh, yeah, on, like, PlayStation, and, uh, oh, man, man, uh, like, Madden 08 is one of my most favorite Maddens ever, um, but yeah, we had a lot of fun playing that, honestly. Like, sometimes we would, uh, just to, just to kind of escape, you know, we'd go hang out with... <gasps> Wait, this said minus, right? Wait a second, wait a second. Uh... Oh, never mind, never mind. Wait, yeah, hang on. Minus... I gotta go check something. Didn't the other one say plus? No. Surely I'm remembering it wrong. Yeah, this one said minus, right? Um, maybe I should... Oh, we knocked off the scope lens. Wow. It's actually a pretty good item. Um, yeah, this one said minus. Didn't the other one say plus? I don't know. I, don't know. I haven't been really been paying attention. Mainly because, to me, plus and minus are basically the same ability, so... Um, Okay, that was a little trippy. That was weird. Uh, but I do need to go back and check our pound hour. Uh, either way, it has been about 20 minutes. So, I, I guess if ours has the minus, I'll check it in between uh, on the editing. 
Because I could have sworn it had a different ability. Could have sworn it had plus. Oh man, don't tell me it had that even so, man. I, I was joking. I was completely like joking about like, oh yeah, it has plus. Uh, how funny would it be if it had minus, you know? Uh, I don't know. I might just be, be being paranoid and I don't know. Well, anyway, to end this episode, let's go back and shh, nice. Level 11 Arc Terra. Let's go back and check our how narrow that we caught, because that one did say minus. Pretty sure this one says plus. attack and special. That's not bad. Alright, let's get out of here. Okay, we made it. Alright, uh, so yeah, that hound yard did say minus. Let me... Let me go here. Huh. Let's heal. Hmm. Well, either way, we didn't fight. It, even if I'm, you know, completely wrong here, if nothing else, we didn't find anything other than, uh, the... Minus ability. Whoa, my game's heck of lagging. I might have something trying to run in the background. Um, let's check Hound Hour. Hound Hour. Um... Oh, okay, it does have minus. I just wasn't paying attention. Okay, well, either way, yeah, we didn't, uh... We didn't run into any Hound Hour with a different ability. So, um... Hmm, I guess I just probably won't use Hound Hour, as sad as it is. Um, yeah, probably just not gonna use it. Yeah, which is unfortunate, because I actually really, really like Hound Hour. And I like that it has a good type in this game, but yeah, we'll just take the Steelion we got here with the uh, multi-type. And yeah, that'll be that. Um, yeah. I don't know, maybe like, um, I remember Shariyama's not too bad either. Um, I'll put him in here just to, um, yeah, this is steel type. That is, I, that I could also consider using this. Um, but yeah, guys, that's basically going to be it for these uh, couple bonus episodes. So, yeah, I'm going to post these after I post the main episode. But uh, I'm just going to save here. And, uh, yeah. So you you should see, like, uh, you know, one or two mainstream episodes first. And then, you know, I'll post these after we, probably after we get to uh, Floroma Town. So, but, uh, yeah, appreciate you guys. Thanks for watching. And, uh, yeah, hope you guys all have a good night. And, uh, yeah, if you decide to check these out, appreciate you. Um, but, yeah, I guess I'll see you all next time on Pokemon Platinum Randomizer. Alright, till then, take care of yourselves and each other.